like to build the world a home and furnish it with love. Grow apple trees and honey bees and snow white turtle dove. I'd like to teach the world to sing. NCTV 45 presents The Thought for the Day. Monday through Friday, we give you a message of spirituality and inspiration. Your host, the Bible in Daniel chapter 7, verses 18 and 27, we read, The dominion of the earth will be given to the holy ones of the Supreme One. Now, how many of you who claim to be Christians see yourselves as a soldier for Christ? In the world, Satan has a kingdom of darkness, and Satan comes to steal, kill, and destroy. His kingdom will eventually be destroyed by the superior force of the kingdom of light, led by Christ and his spiritual warriors. At the present time, however, Christians are involved in a spiritual war, that they fight with the power of Holy Spirit and the invisible armies of heaven. There are twice as many good angels as there are bad angels. Plus, Christians have the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit to come to their side, and this makes it a good fight because we win. But if you think that you don't have to prepare for this end-time battle between good and evil, then you are easy prey for the devil and his armies. All through the New Testament, war language is used to prepare Christians for example, we are told to endure hardships like good soldiers of Christ. We are told to suffer for the gospel, to fight the good fight of the faith, to wage war, to persevere, to conquer, to be victorious, to triumph, to defend the gospel, to contend for the faith. You holy ones of the Supreme One, take dominion over evil in Jesus' name. And that's our thought for today.